But the other thing, uh, you know, if you're going to rent mobile, these are what's called active desiccant dehumidification units. But if you're an owner, you don't need to know all that. You just need to know it's a mobile dehumidification unit. But, you know, one of the things we've learned here is if you want to get that, you got to have power or you got to have a generator. Typically, it's a generator. And a lot of these commercial dehumidifiers are off of 480 volts, 460 volts. Is that 460 right? 460 volt three phase, yep. So some facilities don't have that. Correct. You know? So you have to have the generator for that too. So you need the dehumidification units, which is a portion of, which is part of the process, the duct to the building, which usually that all comes together, and then a, hum uh, a generator, which we're talking about like even. You know, we did a little video on the courthouse. You and I talked about that earlier, the Madison County Courthouse. Yep. They have two 5,000 CFM dehumidifiers there, and there's a 300 kW generator there. Like, I think it's 330. At least the model's a 330, so I'm assuming that's 300 kW-ish. Then you need a lot of fuel to run it, and then you need the DEF to run it as well. So, you know, just, right. just things to keep in mind. And if you're calling a company like you know, is it Service Master? Is that who we were talking? Service Masters, who we're going right. to go see right now. If you're calling a company like them, they have it all turnkey. You don't need to piecemeal this thing together. I'm assuming. 